Yeah, I agree. She is safe, so you don't have to worry about her anymore. And since they're on to Crystal, they're going to be more concerned about her. That's why we have to take you, if you're willing, back to the fortress. Whether you want to be trained or not is up to you. Uh, but I can assure you that the Spectres won't be back here anytime soon, because they'll be watching out for myself and for Durandal and the other demon hunters. But the question now at hand is if you two both do want to be trained. I think so. After the Spectres left town, I brought Crystal back to the Demon Hunter Fortress to be trained by a good friend of mine, Leo. During this time, Durandil also trained Scott, who now went by Fanulos. Then I returned to Sydney to begin training my new apprentice, Michael, who Go. gave himself the Demon Hunter name of Craven. He had decided not to return with the Hunters to the Fortress because he wanted to finish his last year in high school and keep his sister safe in case the Spectres should ever return. Why, hello, Stratic. Cassandra. Meanwhile, Cassandra and Drake tried recruiting Stratic to join the Spectres again after he had left the first time because of Ghost Vapor's death. You really think you could hit me with such a primitive one? Physical persuasion was needed to bring him back. <laughs> but eventually, it worked. Cassandra quietly left the Spectres for a time to continue her own training and mourn her master's death. Oddly enough, she would have hallucinations of him training with her. Yet, Cassandra would be on the watch for any news of Crystal. Very good, Lady Cassandra. But you must be careful because some people may be stronger than you think and may not go down with it. But I know none of them are as strong as you are. I wish that were true. Drake continued to train Andrew, who is now known as Ivan, and sometimes Ivan would also spar with the psychotic specter of them all, Knight Rider, who had taken his master's death very hard. Your cheap tricks will work on me. Kill me. But still, battles ensued near and around where it was thought a crystal may appear or where a hunter could be captured and forced to give information of the hunter fortress. But the Spectres received none such fortune. Finally, six months later, Drake and Ivan decided to plan a frontal attack on the Hunters. And it wouldn't be about the Void or Crystal, it would be about avenging their master's death. Now, remember Spectres. We've all prepared for this for a very long time. Thanks to our master Ghost Vapor, even though he has died recently, we will fight for him under his name. And don't count on any backup from the Demon Hunters since we knocked out their communications since the day they got here. Oh, they're all dead. They just don't know it yet. They're dead from the moment they touched him. But my blade will taste them. That's why we'll fight in the name of our master. For Ghost Vapor. I can't wait to see Fanulus again. 
Last time we fought, I could have killed him. He was right there. He was going to die. Tell me he's going to be there. I'm sure he'll be there. He'll be there. <laughs> he'll be there. <laughs> the night is young, my fellow specters. We should make haste. One thing to mention, no one else touches Caitlyn except for me. She's oh, mine. Please. Oh, you need my help. You know it. You know you do. And I have a magnificent surprise for you. Please. Yeah. Sure, I'll bring yes. you. I pay respect to our master. Be crazy for this. Let's get going. Beautiful night, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I've been meaning to ask you, uh, do you, do you know where, uh, Crystal is? Yes, after the demon hunters rescued her, they took her back to the fortress, so she's safe now. Do you think there could be a battle tonight? There very well could be. <laughs> We're not gonna last the night, are we? You will last the night, Caitlin. That I can promise. But what about you, Michael, and Scott? We'll try our best, but we'll do everything we can to protect you. Hey. Have faith. It's good to keep your hopes alive, Caitlin. Well, I can't promise anything once the Spectres will I understand. Are you ready, Fanulus? Absolutely. Good, because I trust you and I'll need you by my side. Might I add that Stratic, he has a poisonous sword just like Drake, and if he stabs anyone, they could turn into a specter within five days or they could die. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Oh, and where is Craven at? What's Ask him to? yourself. Craven, how are you doing? I'm just fine, don't worry about me. Good to know. Uh, look, you're not, you're not wearing your necklace. Oh, thank you for reminding me. I've killed several specters with just this nail. Where's Drake? If I know him, he'll be the last one to show up. What is your business here? To avenge our master. Rid of my obsession. Thank you, Los. Stratic, it's nice to see you again. So, General, are you and your pathetic friend ready to die? My soul is ready. Good, and you're ready the first to die. Now. 